Sup guys, it's Kendra and Dustin and we are oh, back <laughs> with another episode of Cherry Witch. Previously, we didn't get an end. Did we get one ending in that episode? No. We did not get an ending. But we found something arguably greater question mark. Yeah. Yeah. If you're like, what? What are they talking about? Go watch that episode, because there will be spoilers. In three, two, one. That's right. We found strawberry, aka Lottie? Question mark. I don't know. I don't know if they're related. Well, once again, yeah. Cherry called her younger sister Lottie. Yeah. And so. But why would she lock I up don't her sister get how, in an oven? I don't get how you get Lottie out of strawberry. Right. But we had some theories about if they are siblings, that may explain some things from Berry Witch, which if you haven't watched that, I highly recommend. But I don't understand, yeah, the name thing. Why would you lock your own little sister up in an oven? Well, it also, well... Remember, they have to put puzzles into their rooms because oh, they sometimes Oh, and she got get... locked in there on accident? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. So, let's get into this. I'm excited. Here we go. What save were... This one. Yeah. Boop. Cheats. <gasps> so cute. <laughs> Do you want to be a tiny strawberry? <laughs> don't know if I could. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's not speaking currently, so... So cute! Alright. Do you want to try? Or do you want me to do it? Did I already read as her? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I, I did. Okay, I'll, I'll <laughs> give you a pass this time. <clears throat> I'm just, it, you know... Going that high is probably <laughs> going to come out Elmo. <laughs> Joe. <clears throat> or Stitch. <laughs> Thank you. She appeared nervous, which isn't surprising. She looked incredibly young. Besides being in this situation... Wait. Besides, being in this situation would have anyone fearful and weary. But... Now that I think about it, I recall Cherry mentioning having a sister around her age. This couldn't be her, could it? You're welcome. Do you have a name? Uh-uh. My name is Strawberry. I, I just got it. Wait, what? She just got her name. Oh, so you change your name when you become a witch? Maybe. So maybe she was Lottie beforehand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. I heard nuns do that. Uh, there's a number of cultural things where that can happen. Yeah. Interesting. Aha! <laughs> I like how we question stuff when it's like, just, just click, guys. <laughs> Witches aren't always born with the names that they currently use. Often, when a witch gains their specialty, they change their name to match it. Sort of a by name thing? Mmm. It's not always the case. Wait, it's not always the case a witch will change their name, but it is the most common thing nowadays. Ah, uh, a strawberry witch. I see. Congratulations on getting such a sweet specialty. It's nice to meet you, strawberry. My name's Inquiry. I'm with the Council of Witches. How did you get down here? Uh, um, my sister? Uh, is... Wait, <laughs> switching between the voices. <laughs> is Cherry Pie your sister? Loading Inquiry voice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's my big sister. I, uh, I'm not actually supposed to be here. I remembered hearing strange noises from upstairs. Sister told me never to go down here, but I thought she was struggling with something. 
And I only wanted to help, so I, I went down and found her in the kitchen. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uh, so many voices going on in my head. <laughs> It's only three. <laughs> <laughs> Too many! What was the game where I had like four voices? I don't know! <laughs> uh, I'm just- Strawberry? Cherry, what's happening? I told you not to come down here, sweetie. Go back upstairs, okay? <laughs> I'm in the middle of something very important- Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cherry. Cherry didn't seem like herself. Sure, she was saying nice things, but she looked so scary, I just froze. She was all twitchy. Twitchy and giggly. And I, I don't know how to explain it. I need to think Southern. That's what I've been doing. And now my brain's like, should Strawberry have a southern accent? But it's too late for that. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> it's time to go back upstairs now. I have important business to attend to. These pies don't bake themselves, do they? But you smell like blood. Are, are you hurt? Strawberry, upstairs. But, but, I don't get it. Why do you smell like blood if you're not hurt? She laughed a creepy laugh that I'd never heard before. It was so scary. And then she grabbed me and whispered, People like us were meant to be eaten, Strawberry. I'm simply rearranging the circle of life. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, I'll go back upstairs. <laughs> this day is too important to me. That was when she locked me in the oven. She was gonna... Okay, well, was she gonna kill Strawberry? Or do you think maybe she was just kind of shoving her in a location? I hope <sighs> she's just shoving... I mean, she's a bad person. <laughs> Who <laughs> clearly doesn't care about others. So would I be surprised if she hurt her own loved ones? Not necessarily. At all. Especially considering how twisted she thinks she's in love with Inquiry. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. People are her things. Yeah. And Strawberry's misbehaving. But at the same time, she doesn't seem to want to kill Inquiry. So maybe she's not trying to kill her sister. Complicated, complicated person. Well, that's what I was trying to get at. People are things, and so thus, if they're, you know, and they're they're the way, just put them somewhere. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If people she cares about are her things, right? Other not people like are nothing. You want to break <laughs> your favorite doll or something? Mm. <clears throat> Please let me out! I I just wanted to help. I don't like it in here. <laughs> I promise it'll all make sense soon, Strawberry. I kept crying out for help, but nothing happened. Until you helped me. This poor girl. Cherry seems to have lost her mind. She's no longer aware of the severity of her actions. I need to get this child to safety as quickly as possible. Thank goodness the oven was off. I see. You're awfully brave, Strawberry. There's no need to worry anymore, alright? I'll get you out of here and make sure you're safe. I gave her a warm smile and extended my hand in hopes of che of in hopes to cheer up Strawberry. Oh, okay. Thank you very much, miss. She squeezed onto my hand, taking a deep breath in. I decided to move onwards to the next room. My communicator must be in here somewhere. Walking through the door leading out of the kitchen, we found ourselves in what looked like a cherry-themed waiting room. Oh, is that cherry lemonade? 
Strawberry's eyes lit up with excitement as she rushed towards the drink dispenser. Okay, I don't trust anything in here, so let's not drink any mysterious liquids. Strawberry, wait, we don't know for sure what's in that. It could be poisoned. I put my hand on her shoulder, which seemed to stop the girl from getting a drink. It was a sad sight to see the child frowning up at me, but better safe than sorry. That's what I'm saying! Suspicion grew in my mind as my eyes scanned the room. It was more pleasing to the eye compared to the last two rooms I've encountered. I highly doubt this room is that innocent, though. If you use your investigation skills to see if that lemonade is safe, can you let me know, Miss Inquiry? I'm thirsty. Investigation skills? <laughs> if only my magic actually worked right now, we would have been out of here by already. I wonder, how do you think her magic works? Hmm. How about after we get out of here, I'll get you a big glass of whatever drink you'd like, alright? You just gotta hang in there a little longer. Really? You mean I'm missing Grey? Mm-hmm, of course I do. Unless, of course, you don't want anything. I want something! I want a big glass of lemonade! Oh, or a milkshake with whipped cream and sprinkles? Maybe Cherry would want... Ooh. Ooh. Strawberry stopped talking mid-sentence. A tense silence filled the air. Miss Inquiry, what's gonna happen to Cherry? Is she gonna be okay? My heart sank. I do feel bad for this girl. She's going through so much all at once. She's gonna be okay, kiddo. There's no need to worry. Why was she acting so weird? I don't know, but I promise we'll do our best to figure out why. Okay! Okay. <laughs> Just as fast as it darkened, her mood and demeanor brightened up again. What a strange little girl. Okay, maybe it runs in the family, you think? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, if you remember... <laughs> I do remember, and if you remember, then we remember. <laughs> Keeping a close eye on Strawberry, I began to search the room myself. So, do I get to click on things? What's this? Oh! Oh! I've always wanted to read this book! Really? Now? What's it about? It's about a wolf and a bunny who fell in love! <gasps> wow! <laughs> I read the first few pages in my school library! The book itself doesn't seem suspicious. Maybe it was supposed to be a gift for Strawberry that Cherry hadn't given yet? L-R-M, I think is what it says? It's hard oh. to see. Okay, we can click the doorknob, but I don't necessarily know if that's safe. We know this. Uh -huh. So should we just go down there, or should I click on everything? I don't know. Whatever you want to do. Drawers had some pens and paper stashed inside. Nothing of use. Are you sure I can't even have a little sip? Yes, Strawberry, I'm sure. Oh. I'm avoiding the door, because I'm kind of like, what if something happens when I click it? <laughs> Magic mirror on the wall. Who's the cutest of them all? Strawberry seemed to be distracted by the mirror. I'll leave her for now and investigate it after. A cherry themed clock is ticking. Melodically? I don't know why, but words like that have. Either like, way. My <laughs> brain's <pronounce> like. <laughs> If we weren't in this situation, I think it was charming. 
I mean, no, it's a little much in my opinion. But <laughs> okay, hopefully this doesn't kill us. That's what I'm just slightly worried about. I approached the door with caution to see if it was unlocked. The second my hand touched the knob, however, I heard a familiar sound coming from the mirror. <gasps> I knew it was gonna kill us! <laughs> Howdy! Huh? Jerry? This is a... Wait, premiere? Oh! Pre like a recorded... Okay. <laughs> This is a pre-recorded message that goes off when an unauthorized person is sensed in this room. Silly little meat pie, you're not supposed to escape. Uh-oh. Meat pie? In the off chance that you are authorized and this was triggered by mistake, whoopsies, if you know me well, count all the things you love about me. <laughs> Toodaloo, meat pie! Don't worry now, you're gonna be a part of the everlasting. Uh, suddenly, two large metallic arms arose from the hole where the mirror once was. They snatched strawberry. Shit, this is bad. Hey, let me go, please! I don't wanna be a meat pie! Strawberry. Hang on, I'm gonna get you out of there. Help! Please! The metal arms are squeezing Strawberry tighter and tighter. This is bad. I need to find a way to disable the trap and fast. What was it that Cherry said at the end? There has to be a clue for the other everlasting members. She said, count the things that you love about me, right? Yeah. Is it the clock? Maybe. Oh, I can't interact with him? Okay, I can interact with Strawberry. That's it? Just Strawberry? Unless we have to interact with her first? I have to do something. Say something! Cherry's clue. It might be the only chance I have at saving Strawberry. Oh. Shoot. I have no idea. Count the things I love. Is it a number? Is it count the cherries in the room? Maybe. But do you think it's the combined? Or each single cherry? I don't know. Uh, no. Okay, let's see. Uh, if it's the combined, it's one, two. Wait, shoot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Does the phone count? <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Right? Oh no. Oh, but then there's tiny cherries on the thing. Ah! <laughs> I don't know what to do! What do you think? So just just engine something. 12? 12? I shouted out in desperation, but. deafening crunch rang out through my ears. Strawberry, no, I, I failed. I couldn't save her. A child died and it was all my fault. She didn't deserve this. She was so young. Why did it have to be her? It's all my fault. Ending two of six. Strawberry pie. Ew. Well, well, dang. Okay, that's all I can say. 
I mean, okay, we had to have gotten it wrong because that would have been an ending. <laughs> so in a way, if you think about it that way, it's a win. <laughs> there we go. That's what we're gonna do in this situation. <laughs> I don't know! I have no idea what the answer is. Do you? No. I don't know either. It says count the things that I love. So I feel like it has to be a number, right? So then I was like, oh, we have to count the cherries in the room. But there's so many, like, cherry things that it's like, what? And then, I mean, you could argue that she's a narcissist, so the only thing she truly loves is herself. So then would it be one? You know? Is it even a number? I don't know. Also, do you have to maybe type out the let? Oh, or like, twelve, like, spell it out? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even think about that. This is hard. This is a hard thing. Uh, uh, we're gonna have to figure it out somehow. Maybe through trial and error? Yeah, I'll try to look to see if, if somebody. There's a clue. Cool, I mean, I, I, mean I, I have a walkthrough. Right. <laughs> sort of. I'm just so confused. We'll have to see. I feel like that's such a broad if I can clue. Read it, if, we'll have to see how they find it. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway. I don't want to be necessarily given the answer. Right. But I would like a clue. clue. <laughs> like one more clue. I don't know. I don't have no idea. I feel like it probably is. Unless a number? The number of things she likes in the room. Or. It's the number of things she loves. Uh, yeah. Or it's count the number of things I love or something like that. We'll have to re-see the exact words. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm frustrated because we didn't get it right. But like I said, it's fine. It's fine. We would have had to have been it. It was on purpose. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Killed the strawberry on purpose. On purpose. That's because I didn't understand the clue. Anyway, <laughs> I'm excited to see where this goes. So what is that now? We've gotten one, two, and four? Yeah. So there's one more death scene that we're going to have to get, probably. In between this and then Getting where we were. Again. Yeah. <sighs> I'm excited. It's gonna probably be sad, but I'm excited. I'm so interested in this universe. It's a great game. And yeah, that I highly recommend you check it out. So, if you want to try playing this game yourself, there's a link in the description below. Check it out. Show the creator some love. Um... I'm trying to think. It's Miles Straw Bunny. I always want to put an S every single time. You'd think I'd know it by now. But yeah, show them some love. Um, play the game. Also check out, like I said, I don't know if it's the prequel. I think it's technically, now it's the, or is this a sequel? No, this is the prequel. Yeah. This is the prequel to Berry Witch. So if you haven't watched that yet and you're confused as to why we're freaking out, go watch that. It's great. Just enjoy this universe. If you have any... But we do also have confirmation now that Strawberry is the sister. Yes, that is true. So our theory was right. Possibly. We'll have to wait and see if yeah. that's exactly why. I feel like it has to be, though that makes me mad. So if you're confused as to what we're talking about, you just need to be up to date on the episodes. I'm sorry. That's all I can say. <laughs> We've talked about so many things. But yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying this game. Like I said, check it out. Um... Um, if you guys have any, okay, this is hard because I want to hear your guys' theories as well, but at the same time, it's very delicate. Don't spoil anything. <laughs> so you can always drop those in the comments down below, or you can come and talk game theory with us live on Twitch. We stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, different games, different days. We don't stream this. But, of course, we're always down to have game theory conversations if you want, or you can come say hi. Don't worry if live stream is not your thing. We upload all of our VODs over to our YouTube channel, so if you're curious about what we're playing over there, you can go watch where you are now. Um, but yeah, check out the other games we have available. Like I said, you need to watch Berry Witch if you're watching this. 100% go watch it. It's great. Um, but we have a number of games that are quite like this. We have two other games by this specific creator. Different universe, totally different plot, but nonetheless, still great. It's From the Sun to the Moon, 
and don't let it out. So if creepy but cute games are your thing, there you go, you got some recommendations. If you want to see the other games we have available before you hop into the actual series, you can always go to our TikTok, YouTube Shorts, or our Instagram Reels. Just go a little sneak peek before you hop in. But yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. Sweet. Like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you feel like doing. We will appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!